whatever, but like at least in that set, his Mega Man looked nicer than the Richter for sure. Mm -hmm. uh, and we're gonna move on to losers finals now. Chag versus Master Mario. Uh, yeah, not quite a heavy character, but yeah, there must be some reason why he decided to go Palutena in this matchup. Probably range. Yeah, definitely the yeah. range. Palutena is able to just not let Mario get in because he's you know he's short, he's small. Okay, near to up air, double up airs. In fact, I felt like that didn't do as much damage as I thought it would, but here we are. Right now, Master's going in on this uh, Palutena, not gonna, not gonna hit the uh, the up B right there. That probably would have been the stock too. All right, don't touch my shield. Dang. Again, yeah, don't. No, don't touch my shield, immediate up smash, only 50% on him. Yeah, you can tell Chag is trying to land on him with these neutral airs, because, you know, you, you land a neutral air, you're, Bro, pretty, you you're, gonna, get a, you're gonna get another one. <laughs> yeah, but Nair actually just not safe on shield, you're able to just really punish it with almost whatever you want. Yeah, back so and Chag is gonna have to pay for that. Forcing a high recovery and punishing the landing lag with the down tilt. Again, great reaction from Chag. That was so good, another two frame. Uh, I was gonna say, if he hits three though, neutral get up, not really what you were expecting after. Uh, Whoa. I think he DI'd in yeah, on that. Yeah, he did. He absolutely That's did. That's the only time you really do get hit. See that Palutena down throw up here? But that was a really like smart play from Chad because he, he knew. He knew he was in a DI in. He read that and he got the up air. That's not, also not a typical follow up for Palutena to be going for. Like, I was kind of expecting the raw back air. Like, yeah, like once you get grabbed on the ledge against Palutena, if you DI away, there is that threat of the back air. And then if you DI in, you just get an up air. So you got to make sure you stay calm in those situations. And Chad just going to get the right thing. and. Pretty much evening it back up. Oh, here come the neutral airs. And he's going to toss out the explosive flame. So much damage. Master Mario burning his double jump. Going to go unpunished, though, landing on the stage. Getting grab there. Throwing her off stage. Oh, actually reading the neutral get up right there with the up smash. So scary. Again, another neutral you're gonna hit. That's so that was so unfortunate. Close to flame. Once if you miss within you're between the two of them, they're just that dead zone. We're all gonna get caught out by that back air again. Master Mario up a decent amount. If he gets another hit, this is gonna be so worth it for him. He's doing a really good job of just avoiding getting hit by the things that Palutena throws out. I just realized we've been watching this game and on uh, <laughs> with the player cam up the entire time. Oh yeah. <laughs> I was like, why am I squinting? <laughs> neutral air here, Chag. He goes for another neutral air again, but gonna get stuffed up by the Mario. Uh... Oh, oh, wow. wow. Up smash is so good. It lingers for so long, and even the weak hit is so strong. Yeah. Almost, you could almost say it really doesn't have a weak hit. <laughs> Honestly. Oh, but there we go. There's a circle. Gets a couple of nails, oh. gets some up airs. Oh. Quick 30%. Yeah. Forced uh, Master Mario into a frame trap, unfortunately grabbed in the opposite direction. Oh, yeah, definitely unfortunate. Really good whiff punish there. Not not, uh, not actually trying to shield it, because once you shield it, you're just kind of locked and shield. Also down throw back here, not going to hit. Fair, or, uh, the shield grab literally just missing right in front of Palutena. So Chag is looking to bring this back. He's already got 68% on mass. He just got to get past this ledge trap right here. Oh, I like the weight there, but dang, dang dude. Gold. I'm, dude, wow. <laughs> That's so crazy. I mean, uh, Chag rolled in. Probably not the best call. Obviously, like, he, but he, he just kind of panicked, like, mm -hmm. seeing the up smash right there. He was sitting in shield, tried to get away from it, and got, honestly, like, at the same time, Master Mario, like, lucky that the spacing was just, like, there because that up smash has, like, a dead that's zone Oh, yeah, he was on, complaining on about that hit. earlier. And, I mean, that's how exactly how he lost to S2H earlier. Like, he, he had a read where he got an up smash and it just, like, didn't even hit. But game number two, Master Mario and Chag. That's how you know he's getting serious. We're going full screen for this one. Oh, yeah. Tries to get a bit of a nair string. Nice auto reticle. I'll throw back here. All right, I like that explosive flame to keep the pressure up from a distance. Uh, no true follow-ups after that back air sending with it. It has enough like 
horizontal knockback to really like not you're not gonna get anything after that. Explosive flame. Oh, I like the neutral arrow. Oh, he's dead. Yeah, okay. I like that neutral arrow because it also just got rid of the fireball. And Massmire really likes to come out with oh. that a lot. Oh, okay, jab lock. He waited a little too long on that jab. That was looking so good. He had the fair, barely missed. Missed attack, found out with the jab, but just a little too slow right there. But cashing out with the up B, you're not going to get punished for it, so. But that tripped him. That's <laughs> dang, dude. That's funny. He's just doing it, too. All right. Chag. With a ton of momentum in this second game now. He's already lapping Master Mario in percent, going for the second explosive flame. Right now, he's carrying him from coast to coast right here. And Ooh. the F smash. Chag is turning it up. Sub 100% on his first stock right now. He finds a parry, doesn't choose to punish. Neutral airs, another one. That's three into the up air. Double up air. Yeah, so much percent. And you can see like Chag is consistently like going for like two to three uh, neutral airs before he starts chasing with the up air. I mean like, that third neutral air just seems to like position yourself perfectly for the like the uh, vertical juggle. Like Palatina, crazy. She, she juggles you sideways and then she juggles you up to the yeah, she'll, she just she'll juggle you however she wants to, <laughs> honestly. The master finally getting that first stock right there, but Chag the momentum might be a little too great right there. Goes to the explosive flame again. I like how Chag is really, he's throwing out these back arrows, these dash hacks, and these dares to contest with uh, Mario's fireball, so it's a good way of just getting rid of the press that Masta puts on. Drag down neutral air, finds the grab and the turnaround back air. Wow. That, it will. That was, that was crazy. That is I didn't think that was going to kill, but that. that was a dominating game. Yeah, com completely different from game number one. Yeah, that was, that was a, uh, what's the word, night and day. Night and day. So, evening up 1-1 one, one a piece. See, we're still going to see the Mario and the Palutena. Uh, I suspect we're going to see this exact matchup throughout the rest of the set. Mm -hmm. Haven't really seen Masamaro use too many other characters. And obviously, Chag having the Inkling on deck, but this is just a better matchup. Definitely. Up, oh, getting the oh. getting that last Two, in there. Three comes the up airs. Yep, forcing an air dodge. And I love how he does that turnaround there. If you just nair him off stage, you'll end up dying. But if you do that turnaround, you get to. If you're good enough, if you're not good enough, but if you're uh, fast enough, you're able to just carry him from side to side. Oh, beginning his own combo. Yeah, landing on him with the down with the up air. Put nair back air. That was that was interesting. He actually got the back hit of the fireball into the back air. Goes to the F smash, but gets an F smash of his own right to the face. Okay, running forward for the grab that time. Realize you can't really shield grab or do a standing grab right there, so. Ooh. Nice. Reading the roll with the F tilt. Barely oh missed that explosive God, flame. That was so scary. Charged up smash, still not enough. The next one will do it. Down air will do it, in fact. Oh, yeah, down air will definitely. Lots do of it. kill options online for both players. Going for the backer right there. Oh god. Hi, <laughs> how Dude. how do you just sit there and just shield that? I would have been so I, terrified. I know, I know, right? But as you can see, like last time he rolled and in that position, like the, he had no he couldn't roll back. He either had to jump or roll in, and both of those things were gonna get punished by the by the up smash on release. Definitely so. just really bad position for yeah. Jack and really good for Master Mario. Forward air, yeah. Expected him to go for that. It's definitely a good thing to just put out like, hey, listen, I could do this. If you don't react fast enough, you're giving me a free stock. Oh, hello. That, that Nair didn't seem like it should have killed, but uh, it did. The DI might not have been the greatest, but you know what? That Nair kind of does everything. Oh, okay. Getting a little yeah. bit fancy with the uh, teleport cancels. I, I, I feel like it's a really good idea once you come down. Uh, a lot of oh. players will have invincibility, so you just very get true. to teleport cancel and just throw them off. So you get to waste their invincibility. That is very true, yeah. A little bit of a stalling ca tactic. Double oh up air. God, the damage. Don't get Paul. Don't let Paul Tana get a hit. Here's a down throw for Chag. And here's the frame trap for yeah. Chag. The uh, raw back air not connecting, but of course forcing out the air dodge, which gets allows him to get another grab. Paul Tana just is such a monster in this game. Honestly, she deserved it with how like how dirty they did her in Smash Four. Absolutely, she's a goddess, man. No, no reason to be bad. So right now, already even in the back up. You just, let Paul Tana get one conversion. Ooh, that back here was 
Yeah, man, risky. Put himself off stage. Oh, oh realizing that. Yeah, once you get past that explosive point, Palutena is just a sitting duck. Yeah, that was like one of the few times I've seen Chad go for an explosive flame where it wasn't like the most ideal situation. Here's a down tilt. If he got a raw back air, that would have killed, but he got like, like a sour spot on the forward air. Actually, forward air may, may have done it too. Oh. Interesting idea. Maybe he was expecting Master to just do an air dodge. So he was just waiting there, but Master's just going off stage. Okay, expert timing for Master Mario there. So right now, still not being able to get that uh, hit off. Quick counter. Actually, the first we've really seen from here, but F Tilt finally going to take it 180. Yeah. F Tilt really good at just covering a lot of ledge options, but at that roll distance, it's not really going to kill. It's there just for damage. Okay, oh, jump out of shield. It's another Nair confirm. Great short hop, getting that fair, missing the fireball too. All right, Mass Mario coming through with a vengeance though. No, I like that uh, teleport away. No use in trying to sit on the shield against Mario. Oh, oh. he had that idea, but just not gonna hit yet. I, I thought he just did there. Again, rolling, barely gonna lift that up, that up smash. Yeah, such great spacing from Mass Mario. I mean, the ledge trap is super real right there. Uh, knowing that like Chag has been opting for the normal getup a lot of the time. Oh, when that F smash is gonna take it? No. no. Wow, I am I'm genuinely oh, surprised. That. That's not gonna be it though. Oh, oh snap. See, that's a that's the only unfortunate part about doing that runoff nair. Because if it doesn't kill, it sends you up towards the blast zone. So characters with like not the best recovery are gonna be able to recover from it. Oh god, dude. <laughs> Bro, he really sat there and shielded that. What a yeah, so I mean, brave. That one he could have definitely rolled backwards. He had enough room on the stage. Honestly, if he wanted to, he back probably throw. could have just uh, countered. But back throw not going to take it just yet. Great. How are we still living? Air here? dodging into the, in the blast zone to prolong his life a little bit longer. Jag oh play so well back air. Finally going to take that right there. Right, Going up to one with the mini fist bump. So yeah, going up 2-1, that definitely could have been Chag's game. I really thought that Smash was going to kill there. He was at 80. I thought I thought he had it, but you know what? It happens. I'm listening to Master Mario. They're talking in Spanish right now, and he was like... Yeah, right now Chag's just kind of trying to calm it down. It was such a close yeah, game. Yeah. Got a little bit of nerves going on, but yeah, I was Master Mario was telling, uh, giving him props for his palutena. He's like, I, "Me gusta tu palutena." <laughs> so here we go, game number four. Master Mario up to one. Just one more game, and he gets to uh, find himself in uh, grand finals against Quick. Quick, who's been just waiting. Really big stage here, obviously, with the the blast zones um, being really, really high. Uh, the platforms on the side, it's going to be better for Master Mario, if anything. So it's interesting that he went to this stage. I, the only thing I can see is that he, he probably like saw that he was losing a ton of stocks to up smash. So he figured, uh, actually, there's two things. He was losing a ton of stocks to up smash. So he's going to be able to survive a lot longer on this stage. And the platforms actually do serve him because he's able to get up off of the ledge a lot easier, having that option there. True. And I, you could also assume that he doesn't want those platforms in the middle of the stage because Master would get a lot of extensions. That's so he'd, also he, true. Yeah, so he'd only get them in the corner. So, like I said, a lot of things probably going in, running into that eclipse game, not going to kill yet. Kalos, again, really big stage. Going for the jab. Oh, my God, dude. Master Mario is crazy. Dude. Oh, oh my great. God, Good bro. Stuff. Yeah. Oh, he had to. He I had think he realizes, like, if I keep holding, I'm actually going to lose my stock. <laughs> Oh my gosh, almost Three. being hit by the up smash. Oh, Going the turnaround, the yeah. Yeah, protecting right there on that platform, but Paulo doesn't care. She's still going. Reading that air dodge in, that was so clean from Master Mario. Gonna even it up. Jack taking a bit of a breath right there on the angel platform, just trying not to get opened up by Mario again, because he knows once he gets hit, he's gonna take so much damage. Okay, that's Mario finding the opening once again with the up throw into the up air. Getting back here again. Right there. 
Actually, I could see I could see this stage being actually really good for Palutena now that I think about it. And uh, he used it in this game. Even if Chag wins here, it's going to be Master Mario's counterpick. And I, I can bet if <laughs> Chag wins here, he's banning the stage. <laughs> Absolutely. Now you not come back here. Rolling past the S smash, able to get a grab of his own. A little bit of a miss input there. I think there. he was trying to go for an attack cancel, but yeah, he, that makes sense. He messed it up. Yeah, I like how he's not really trying to just do a, a shield grab off of those, off of that up smash. He realized he's taking. It's been so close once it happens. Oh, I was so close right there. Down air, not gonna kill just yet. Again, Kalos doing them runders. All right, oh, trying to challenge here, yeah. him right there. That's Mario, one stock away from securing his victory and advancing into grands. Jack is going to do his best to make sure that doesn't happen, but things are just, it looks like he's falling apart for Chag right now. Tries to get that up here out of shield, but we're still going. Masters, he, he's looking ready. He has this momentum. Chag's just trying to look for this stock. He's throwing things out, but he's not able to kill right now. Yeah, Master Mario. Was just, oh my god. He tried to parry it. That was so good. <laughs> that was ballsy, man. Why would you do that? <laughs> like, I'm out, dude. I'm on my I'm on my last stock. I'm out of here, bro. <laughs> bro, Master. Master giving a little yes for that. He did so well on that one. <laughs> Damn. Oh, Matt. Master's why, been sitting down. Why your, leg, why your legs hurting? Oh. Yeah, Master getting up, walking around, because you know. He's playing like he wants to win this tournament, so. For sure. Moving on to Grand Finals against Quick. Quick's been doing so many 